Welcome back, viewers, to Grand Capital Smash. This is Loser's Quarters between Milo and Viren. Both players uh, on the come up. Nice call out. Oh my goodness. Not a lot of features do that. If only you could have finished that edge guard. Let's see. Get down the smash to get him out. Turn up? No. Okay. There we go. Turn up. No, I chose. Uh, probably the one at a different angle. Oh, that was an excellent wave by the Okay. Surprised they actually struck here. Usually the foxes. Foxes usually ban Fountain and FD, I think. Fountain. I'm actually not sure. Oh, should have read the jump there. All spaces like the jump there. Yep, nice. He's pressing on with his uh, shield advantage. Oh, Emmanuel doing the knitting. The knitting as a you jump up, drop your turnip, and then pull up another turnip, I think. Ambitious toad. Nice, nice dash attack. Almost caught it. Looks like, yeah, Milo is taking up to the platforms to like deal with uh, the float a little bit better. Because once you're uh, kind of below Peach, a lot of her hitboxes are pretty strong from hitting below. Nice there. Nice call out. If you only dared there, I guess it was a bit slow. Yeah. With punish the missed full cancel. Only Fox can do that. <laughs> well, easier than other characters. Yeah, you ran out of space to run around. Up there? Oh no, down. On an attack situation. Not smash. No. Well, I, I, I like the fair. He just didn't position himself high enough. Oh! Surprised he came down with a float and then down smash instead of a full cancel area. Yeah, the fox kind of wants to milk his lead right now. Yeah, he's back on. The uh, flubby wait, ledge dash. Yeah, he wanted a ledge dash up smash. Every fox wants that. Aw, uh, just short of the platform. Because of the lasers, lasers forced the other person to approach, and Peach had to make a decision how to combat it. But I think he guessed wrong. Found pretty standard Peach stage, just because the closed space makes her large hitboxes more threatening. Yeah, it looks like uh, Virence is, uh, he's not uh, recognizing the laser 
how, how Milo wants to laser and how he wants to make an approach from that because uh, he's been dash dancing, dash back and then uh, nearing or in the case of the last match he up smash so uh, Emmanuel or Beerence has he's got to uh, overshoot a bit from where he uh, Milo is lasering yeah this time uh, Milo's mixing it up Get up attack or dash attack. Just went in and got it. Maybe Virence has fallen to something. Yep. Oh, power shield. Oh, he had him in shield. Should have grabbed or something. Dead? Yeah. No, 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 don't, don't challenge Fox up there. <laughs> nice. Oh, no. Yeah, you can't... The ledge is so good. You get invincibility from it. Yeah. Nice. I caught the jump or something. There we go. Probably a Nair. Nice. Surprised he hasn't done like a uh, shine. Jump cancel shine. Oh. Yeah, but I'm surprised he hasn't done the shine jump cancel shine to another one. Like Milo. Looks like the one type of person would be very capable of it. Ooh, dangerous, dangerous. It's always interesting to see how the lack of the left platform during that moment changes how. It would have panned out if there was a platform. Milo's very good with those drop in shines. I'm not too sure what Peach can do to fight it though. Nice. He's gonna roll, yeah. Wow, what a call out. Milo on game point. Uh, brings him back to fountain. Kind of agree. Good stage for Peach in general. No, don't rely on the platform. Oh, never mind. Let me make me eat my words. Yep. It looks like he might have caught on that uh, Milo might be doing early aerials. Oh, he must, yeah. I think he's got hit by quite a lot of, quite a few dash attacks. Milo's got to be uh, more recognizant to uh, just run and shield that. Once you get a good habit of uh, Peach's dash attacks, a uh, good tell on Peach's dash attack, you can really make her pay for it. Oh, going risky. Should have teched that. Fox is broken. Okay, up smash, or er, up air.
Oh. Turn that guy. Nair. Ah, uh, wrong way. Oh, excellent. Crouch cancel. I'm actually so happy that another Ottawa player uses Crouch Cancel like that effective. Catch it! Oh, didn't catch it. Nice. Oh, I like that. Yeah, Viren's playing pretty well. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm eating all my words. Turn up, yeah. I think Virence has got to mix up his approaches. He's approaching with a lot of dash attacks. Nice, nice down smash. Another down smash. He's he's on the roll right now. You should stay out of Fox's invincible ledge dash distance. Pretty dangerous unless they have a good tell on what they're trying to do. Viren is on the board. Uh, two, one, still in Milo's favor. You'll probably have to deal with a uh, stadium, yeah. Pretty good anti, is that Stitch? Okay. Yeah, pretty good anti Peach stage. A lot of characters will take Peach here. Nice, way bash. He's got to change up that wave dash back and then dash attack approach. Looks like Milo's catching on. And Milo seems to like his fade back bears a lot. If uh, Emmanuel can catch on to that, he'll be in a good position. Looks like an up air? No. I don't think it's guaranteed on Peach either, but you never know. Nice. Yeah, Viren's has got to watch out for his full cancel pairs. It looks like. Milo's uh, scouting out for an up smash. It's just the transformation being wonky. Um, I don't know. Don't go there. <laughs> I wouldn't challenge it. Ah, okay. Ooh, scary down smash for Milo. Yeah, they both. These both. These guys both like to fight. Um, yeah, Emmanuel's gonna get out of there. Bad position. That was weird. Is that a downside just can cancel? Okay. Nice call out on the movement. Probably one up, yep. Side B, I knew it. Okay. Nice short. Nice jabs. Watch out, yeah. He could have up smashed. Pretty sure he could have up smashed. Would have been the end of. I think he even might die at 84. Yeah, Milo's, Milo's realizing those float heights where he can just snipe him with an up smash. Okay. Well played by Emmanuel. Er, Viren. It is patience by Milo. He's like, I think he's hungry for an up smash. He's looking. Wants the floaty character to like make a bad approach. Nice. Oh, cancel. No. Up there? No. Hello? Yeah. Should have uh, changed up the timing, but it's always hard to do in the moment. I don't know why they keep trying to fight each other on these transformations. It looks pretty, pretty dangerous. Okay, 
Yeah, di very difficult to challenge Fox's bear. It's more range than one would think. <coughs> Oh, he faded back. Okay. Wow. Nice little cancel fair. There, might be dead. He's gonna jump. Probably hold on to edge. Yeah. Veerance up. He's got a milk in some percent. Yeah. Sometimes I wonder if it's okay for just Peach to hold shield instead because like there's not much uh, Fox could get out of a grab. Like you can get up throw but I'm pretty sure up throw up air is not a thing on Peach if she, if she expects it. Down smash. Oh, I think Veerance knew he wanted to side B there. Uh, turn up? No. Nice. I think every other Peach would have panicked down smash there, but chose the right option within there. Game five. This is this is actually pretty entertaining. Back to stadium. Oh, he got another stitch. Getting a lot of those stitches. Nice. Down smash. He got another stitch. Are you serious? Oh. It looks like uh, Viren should go to the lottery. Maybe he'll win something. And I am joined by the great Ottawa Dirt. I've sobered up a little bit. I'm going to do better. Oh, were you not saying coherent things earlier? Oh, no. I was just like being a dumbass. It no. was, it was, it was <laughs> wall ATPN. I mean, like, you can only offer so much insight in a matchup. Link Falco. You're like, oh, Link's going to run around and throw bombs. Falco's going to dodge the bombs. <laughs> Falco's going to combo Link. Right now we have game five though with Milo and Virence. Yeah. So I didn't see the first two games. It's I don't actually know the been pretty good. Very consistent. I don't know about consistent, but like I think they're adapting to each other. Okay, so like well. yeah, they're like no one, no one's like it's been going back and forth. Like it's games. it was two zero in Milo's favor. Oh really? And then okay. Emmanuel's. I I think it back. in that situation yeah. Emmanuel's gonna like not gonna nice. win, but Emmanuel okay. plays so much better the longer the set. I find sometimes. Yeah. Okay. And he he's very good at adapting. Okay. Oh. I think he pulled two stitches and that was a bomb right there. Check this man's controller, man. I think he should try his luck at a lottery ticket. Yeah, yeah. He just got killed at 64% with an up smash. No, he got killed by 84. Well, he was at 84 when he died. Oh, no, no, no you're right. You're right. Yeah. So that's, that's a that's floaty a life. That's a floaty low percent right there. It oh, sucks. Good dash attack. Yeah. Shot. Oh, oh, my God. He's yeah, so close. He had the right idea. Yeah. That would have been really good. That would have been a really early stock, too. Yeah. Milo is playing safe. He's getting away from the turnips, hiding underneath the platform where they can barely hit, and he has to force Emmanuel to come and commit to him. And in that situation, that's when the Peach is going to lose. The Peach is the one that want to play patient and maybe catch a mistake. That was a sick conversion right there. Again, good idea. Just misses the execution on the uh, edge guard. Yeah, he, he was expecting the low angle, which like wouldn't be surprised if the Fox did that. A lot of Foxes are choosing ledge now because the... The ledge is so good. Well, the improvement of ledge dashing within the invincible ledge dash is that a lot of Foxes are capable of doing that. Oh, that's... Yeah. Ooh, the SDI got followed up. Okay, okay. Milo in the tree. Oh. He cheeky, said, no. Cheeky back here. Let me just back here. He says, I know how to do this. I oh, this is not good. No, not good. he's getting wobbled. How's he going to finish this? Oh, 
by getting 100% and then shining. Oh! Game five. Whoa, well played. Did you see that? That tree?